women chase after men who do this. If you want women to be chasing after you, if you want women to want you as their own, then you have to do all these things I'm going to be talking about in this video. So the very first thing you have to do if you want women to chase you is live an interesting life. Women love men who live an interesting life. The worst thing you can do to a woman is to make it as if your life revolves around her. The moment a woman understands or has that feeling that you are so obsessed with her to the point that your life now revolves around her, she will not find you attractive. She will run far away from you. But if a woman sees that you have hobbies, you have friends that you hang out with, that you spend time doing interesting things, she will find you more attractive. Women love it when a guy is not chasing them so hard. It's okay to make a woman know that you have good intentions for her, that you want to date her, that you want her to be your own. But when a woman perceives that you don't have any level of fun in your life, you don't live an interesting life, she will not find you attractive. She will see you as a guy who she will not even love to date. So live an interesting life, have hobbies, hang out, go to nice places, take pictures, post on your on the gram. Women will love you. Women will find you attractive. Women will want to be part of your life because you are living an interesting life. Don't always make it as if your life revolves around a woman. Don't always try to force yourself on a woman. Don't always give a woman all your attention. She will not find you attractive. But when a woman sees that this my guy is living an interesting life, they will work harder to get your attention because they now see that, okay, this guy can even do without me. Then now try to secure him for myself. The second way to make women to chase you more is create competition anxiety. When you are dating a woman, don't make it obvious that it's only her that you love. It's only her that you have in your life. Women always want to be with men who other women want. How do you create competition anxiety? Dress well. Be more attractive. Make yourself more attractive. Be more successful. Make more money. When a woman sees that you are always attractive, you're always looking sexy hot, and you're even getting more successful as the day goes by, she'll be afraid that if I misbehave, this guy can easily replace me in a twinkle of an eye. This guy can replace me in a snap. And every girl out there would be happy to take my spot in his life. Therefore, I have to work harder to keep him to myself. I have to be at my, at my best behavior. I have to chase him harder so that, you know, all his attention is on me. Women always want to be with high-value men. So be a man who is attractive, dress well, smell nice, look good, look sexy, so that other, other women can give you those signs that they want you. And when your girlfriend notices this, she will even chase you harder, so that no other girl out there will snatch you away from her. Be more successful. Women want to be with successful guys. When a woman knows that you are successful, and you are even getting more successful as, as days go by, she will not want to lose you. So in all you do as a guy, be more successful, be more attractive. It will make a woman to have this anxiety that if she doesn't be if, if she doesn't behave very well, she will lose you. And that will make her to be at her best behavior. The third thing you have to do if you want women to chase you harder is always be willing to walk away. The worst mistake that I see some guys making is they always tolerate all the BS, all the bullshit that their women throw at them. A woman will disrespect you, a woman will misbehave if she knows that you are not willing to walk away. If a woman knows that you cannot walk away, her character will get worse. But once a woman has gotten to that point where she knows that this guy doesn't tolerate nonsense, this guy doesn't tolerate misbehaviors, this guy doesn't even have time to start correcting you, that's any little thing you do, he will only warn you once, and if you don't agree or don't change, he will walk away. They will respect you more. When a woman knows that no matter how much, how, how bad she behaves, you will always be there because you love her too much. She will only get worse. She will start seeing you as a weak man. She will start seeing you as a guy who is not even worthy of respect. Because it means that you don't have much options out there. Because for you to tolerate a woman, that means you don't really have much options. Because a man who has options, who can easily replace that girl in a snap, will not sit down there and tolerate disrespect from a woman. He will change her in a twinkle of an eye. He will replace her. And that will increase your sexual market value in her eyes. Because she knows that, okay, this guy has many other girls out there who want him. But when, once you're not willing to walk away, it will reduce your sexual market value. 
and a woman will be like, okay, this guy is tolerating my disrespect. Maybe he knows that I am the best he can do. I am the best he can get. Therefore, girls out there don't want him. Let me let me misbehave more because he's still going to tolerate me and he's still going to stay with me. Don't let women see you as a weak guy. Don't let women see you as a guy who doesn't have much options. They will treat you badly. And of course, you will have a lot of bad experience dating women. The fourth thing you have to do if you want women to chase you is you have to be good in bed. It's as simple as that. If you want a woman to be chasing you, because there are some women who for them, a good sex means a lot to them. That's the truth. So if you want to also have women chasing after you on a sexual level, you have to be good in bed. You have to improve your sex game. Not many guys out there are really good in bed. This is what most of you guys don't know. Not many guys out there are good in bed. A lot of guys are struggling sexually. So if you become a guy who is good in bed and women experience what it means to be with you sexually and you are good and you satisfy them, most times they will chase you. Most times they want to have you all to themselves, especially if you are now attractive and if you are successful and you are also good in bed. Every woman will want you to herself. No woman will want to experience such a guy and then lose him. No, they will work harder, they will chase you more just to make sure you belong to them and you belong to them alone. When a woman loves you and likes you so much, she doesn't want to share you. She wants to have you all to herself. So these are the things you must know as a guy. 